All right, Shalom. We the GMS SF Bay Brothers on our way to the battlefield. We're just doing another brief and transit video. First off, we want to give all praises to Yahweh, Ba'ashem, Yahweh Shai. Double honors to our apostles and elders. And Shalom to all the Akim out there preaching his word, truth, sincerity. We're just going to go through the spirit. But we're going to start off with uh, you know, 2 Corinthians and 2 and 11. This is uh, the book of 2 Corinthians, chapter 2, verse 11. Least Satan should get an advantage of us, for we are not ignorant of his devices. Yeah, we're not ignorant of his devices, because, uh, like, brothers uh, seeing that shooting that happened this week, that's one, another one of Satan's tricks. Because it's like, there's so many different things popping up just in that one situation. They said at first it was one shooter, then it's multiple shooters, then uh, ICE is taking the claim for it. It's like, it's always... It's always a, a bad shooting that happens and then what's the next thing that Esau do? He says, oh, now we need to take your guns away. We need to more straight their gun laws. And it's always, it's basically just Satan trying to just throw his, his part of his devices, trying to trick the people, masses of the people. Because then whenever people get scared, that's when they give away their rights. Just so they can feel that so-called protection from Esau. But that's going to lead to their destruction at the same time. Because Esau is trying to ultimately gear up for his new world order. That's why he got all these different false flags happening all the time. You know? I, I looked into the word um, devices and it's um, it's from the Greek. Uh, it says no, no, noema, I believe. Let me see if Esau pronounced it. Naima. 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 Okay. And it says a mental perception, thought, an evil purpose that which thinks the mind thoughts or purposes so you know basically Esau's what uh, uh, witchcraft you know his deception basically you know painting a picture basically uh, uh, making making a bit uh, what do you say uh, a, a play you know fake blood act actors you know false witnesses Cause all this is just like a setup, uh, a setup play, man. It's nothing more different than Esau making, making a movie, you know, fake scene, all right, fake scenario, you know, drama, all right. People, uh, 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 uh how do you say? Um, I can't, I can't, for, uh, I can't think of the word right now. It's for the T, theatrics, okay, you know. That this is all that, that that's coming from, and then what Esau putting on his fluff news throwing it over in people's faces, all right? Building up the numbers, all right? We found this many people uh, wounded, these many people dead. This is the worst, uh, uh, the worst uh, terrorist act on, on uh, American soil ever in history. In, in modern history. Modern history. All these are a part of uh, Esau's uh, devices, man. Because Esau is the physical counterpart of Satan. You know, he's doing the bidding of Satan. He's doing the bidding on a, on a bigger a scale of, of Yahweh on the left-hand side, which is through Satan, you know? Yeah. Uh, yeah. Uh, Revelations 12 and 12 Therefore rejoice ye heavens and ye that dwell in them Woe to the inhabitants of the earth and of the sea For the devil has come down unto you having great wrath Because he knoweth he have but a short time Yeah and, and that woe means destruction Because that's all that Esau is going to bring he's, His blessing was the sword So he's not going to bring you peace and safety Like he always claimed You got Trump saying Make America great again. America is never going to be great. Yeah. America is going to be destroyed. That's the only thing that's going to happen to America. That's the only thing that's coming to America is destruction. Yeah. That's why it says. To, um, that's why it says in Revelation 12 to, and 12 to rejoice. Yeah. We the only ones that's rejoicing because we we're going to be happy about the destruction of this place. But the rest of these people, they're going to be weeping and mourning. And and this is a part of Esau coming down with grave wrath, making these uh, uh these false flags, these terrorist attacks, to what? Further shake up you people, all right. Further get you dependent on the government to go with what giving away, giving away your uh, defense, basically your your arms, yeah, all right. Or, depending more, oh, no, go ahead. no, depending more on um, on the government, the so-called police. You don't ever see that when when these when these uh, uh, Edomite cent uh, centurions, all right. You niggas and speaks that's a part of this too. You know, you shoot shooting Jake, man. You don't ever hear them talk about taking away their weapons. What do they say? Uh, justice, put on body cams, this and that, all right, which is not going to prevent you niggas from getting smoked, man. They're still going to get away with it with you niggas on camera and uh, leaking out, you know. But what that's going to get you people to what, uh, uh, 
give away your arms so you don't have no defense when Esau come in like a flood. The martial law troops come in shooting you, pulling you out the bed early in the morning, all right? You know, raping your woman, you know? So it, uh, so this is further playing into Esau's uh, um, um, hand, okay? And what, uh, he, he, he calls it um, order out of chaos, okay? Causing chaos so he can come in with his so-called solution which is which is what ultimately the new world order. You taking the RFID microchip because he's gonna he's he's gonna crash the society, man. All right, everything is gonna look all peachy and cream like today, man. These people were doing doing the same shit, shopping today, dropping. All right, being being um being uh consumers. All right, useless eaters. Okay, then one day you're just gonna wake up. You're you can't go to the the, the bank no more. All right, the FRN notes that you have not even worth anything. All right. You can't get no food, cause hey, the truckers ain't ain't coming in. Cities are seized, you know. You're gonna be very uh, uh very vulnerable to e Esau, man. You people are gonna be begging for the for that RFID microchip, man. You know. You got it. Uh, Psalm 17 and 13. Arise, O Lord, disappoint him, cast him down, deliver my soul from the wicked, which is thy sword. Yeah, and the wicked is Esau, because yeah. according to Job in nine, 9 and 24, the wicked is controlling the earth, and that's Esau, and he's the one that, he's a, he's, a, he's a, um, Yahweh Bashem Yahweh Shai's whooping stick, all right? He's the one that's the, that was meant to just bring nothing but destruction. He took, like it says in Revelations, he took peace from the earth. It, the earth was at peace before Esau came over here and just fucked everything up. Literally everything got messed up the moment that Esau stepped his foot over here. The water, the animals, shoot, the food, the soil, the trees. That's why the scriptures say that the trees are even mourning and they're going to rejoice when Esau go down. Because that's how much he done destroyed this whole earth. And you got people that actually believe that Esau is going to be able to travel to different planets. He would just repeat the process. Just like you see in the movies, like that movie, uh... What's the, what was that movie when you uh, when they went to the other uh, Interstellar? Interstellar. Yeah, the, it, just like Interstellar, they basically Esau destroyed the, the Earth to the point to where you couldn't even live here no more. I and mean, what they do, just go to another planet, repeat the process. Eventually, that next planet they went to in the movie, if it was to continue, it, the same shit would happen. It, that's just Esau. That just show you that's just Esau. He doesn't know how to do anything but destroy. And he only only the least is going to be the ones that's taken care of when that time, when they when the time of Jacob's trouble. Only the least are going to be like eating good, and as far as like that, uh, other than the men of the Lord, the only the least that's tr over there at the top people, they're going to have their doom, doom bunkers and all this other stuff. Because Esau, that's that's just his main goal, man. He's Destroying sure. everybody. Esau going to escape the judgment. Because his judgment is to go to <laughs> yeah. slavery. I'm, I'm talking about the elites. Right. These regular everyday crackers, they're going to be burnt up in a nuclear holocaust. But the uh, the top elites, the uh, well, you could consider the the wicked elect of the elites, the the the, the elites, their top uh, banking families, they're gonna be the first fruits of slavery. Yep. Because because the hey because the righteous elect and the and the uh, uh, the wicked left hand elect are, are both gonna make it. You know, because the elect uh, on the right hand, all right, which is really the only elect. Okay, the Lord don't talk about no wicked the wicked elects and all that shit, man. Yeah. You know, we, we're just saying for, for, you know, putting it in the proper perspective. Hey, man, the, the elect are going to make it out here and what? The wicked elites, man. They're going to make it so they can be uh, rounded up by the elect to be the first fruit of slaves. You know, hey, man, because you we, we're, hey, man, we're we're going to need servants to, to, to build, build the kingdom up, man. You know, and to bring back their own kind, you know, the rest of their heathen uh, 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 nations. All right. You know, to get to work, man. Hey man, cause this thing ain't gonna move quick. This thing is already moving quick, man. Cause as soon as, hey, as soon as Esau made this chip mandatory and, and, and start uh, um, forcing this chip, uh, chip out on Jake, all right? Start putting his hand towards the Lord's prophets, okay? Yeah. You know, man, this, the Lord gonna move very quickly, all right? This place gonna be nuked before we know it, man. We gonna, hey man, we gonna be, uh, uh, shit, man, in the kingdom, you know, whipping the shit out of Esau before you know it. It's gonna go so quick. You know, it's going to be a, um, how do you say, um, a changing of places, man. You know, it's that fast. All right. Yeah. And when we in the kingdom, we're going to look back like what we, everything we went to was a light thing compared to what we're going to receive. Yeah. Because right now, like you can't, 
it's our time right now like the scriptures say one day to the lord is a thousand years to us so it feels like forever for us but then once we're in the kingdom we're gonna be like man that really was nothing yep. that was only like a cup like you know a day a day or two or second half a day however long it was in the lord's time we're going to realize that this is really nothing that we went through because we're when we in the kingdom we're going to just be beating beating esau and enjoying ourselves yeah. oh you, you got something i got something so isaiah 14 and 5 the lord have broken the staff of the wicked and the scepter of the rulers yeah esau you're not as you're not as strong as you once was your oppress your your oppressive hand all right your your staff your rulership is not as strong as it once was your your, your left hand your left hand jab ain't, ain't working like it used to man you know and these countries these these different nations are starting to see that they're having they're having their uh nuclear capability ability strengthened all right their troops okay their missiles all right their allies okay their resources intact man to where they don't have to depend on esau no more and they're not afraid of esau anymore you know hey man you got the prophets out here cussing you out in your own kingdom all right letting you know you letting you know what, what time it is all right so that lets you know that esau doesn't has don't have a, a stronghold like he once did man the lord has broken his staff in the spirit man and, it, and, and we're seeing the the physical manifestation of it you know this is the end of esau's world man he's down all right this is the this is as good as to get for esau man all right it's not going back to the, the 60s and the 50s man where, where esau was at the height of his strength okay we're, we're now at the um at the decline of Esau's uh, 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 his rulership, or right? his strength, his stature, everything he he he, he labored for and murdered for, man. He lied and and stole over, you know. He's 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 losing it. it. Says he who smote the people in wrath with a continual stroke. Yeah, man. Hey, Esau's gonna come with that same wrath, you know. Revelation twelve and twelve, man. He gonna come down. He gonna show you his horns. You you so called Negroes, Latinos, Native Americans. He gonna show. His true hatred for you guys, man, because he know he's on his way out of here, man, and he gonna fight like hell to to uh to change it, you know, to keep everything, to keep it, to keep his dominion, his rulership. Hell, he gonna fight against the Lord and the angels, you know. So what more? What, what much more? The Lord's chosen people, man, you know. Yeah, he's got that hatred for you that Esau always had for Jacob. Yeah, he really got that. Like, he right now Esau just hides the hatred and try to be PC about it. But then when it when that um that that wrath comes, for according to Revelation twelve and twelve, he really gonna show his true hatred. He not gonna he not gonna front no more. Not gonna hide it. He gonna be straightforward with you, trying to just put you to death, showing his real hatred that he always had for you. So he that ruled the nations in anger is persecuted and none hindereth. That's right, man. Hey, man, the Lord is gonna have open season on you, uh, Edomites, man. Everybody's gonna have dibs on you, you know. These nations, these nations already see that you that you out of here, man. They already plotting on on um um on who's next, you know, who's next to rule. That's why it says in, in, in Psalms, I believe, what the first chapter. Why do the heathen rage? A heathen rage? Imagine a vain thing, you know, because they they see you down, Esau. You don't think everybody know that you down you down in the spirit, man. Somebody's uh, somebody's gonna be up next in that rulership uh, uh, seat, man, and that's the nation of Israel from from uh, Yahweh Shai on down, man. You know. You hear the nations, you going right where Esau into slavery. The only difference is after a thousand years, Esau is going to be exterminated. You know? You hear the nations, you're going to get your land back, all right? You're going to be treated fairly, but you're still going to be under uh, uh, under tribute of the Israelites. You're still going to have to worship uh Yahweh Bashim Yahweh Shai. And every time that you that you mess up, we're gonna we're gonna be right there to put you right back in your place, man. You know? So hey man, these other these other nations, every, every this whole earth has been uh afflicted by Esau, man. So what this whole earth is rising up against Esau, man, you know, and that's all the, the doings of Yahweh Bashim Yahweh Shai, because the Lord is against you, Esau. The Lord said, I hated Esau, man. All right. You think you hate somebody. The Lord hates you, man. That's a That's a hatred that you can't even uh, 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 imagine. You know, the Lord created you just to be hated and destroyed, you know. Since the whole earth is at rest and it's quiet, they break forth into singing. Yeah, and this is all going to happen when Esau is taken out of rulership, when America is, is, is completely destroyed, all right? When wickedness is put to an end, all right? And with what? When the righteous are in authority, it says, uh, uh, 
how they say it, when uh, when the wicked are the uh, uh, are when the righteous are in authority, the people rejoice, yeah. the earth rejoice. But when the um, when the wicked bear rule, the people mourneth, yeah. and everybody is mourning, man. You know, you wouldn't be having false flags like like this shit in Vegas going on, people crying, pray for this, pray for that. All this fake That's love. The only time they want to pray is when they catch in hell. Yeah, they get judged. Mm -hmm. Everybody was out there just turning up, committing all type of wickedness, and yeah. it just like being demons. And then all of a sudden, now it's a uh, our everybody. Like, I was watching the news after that shooting happened. The dude said that er, it's, it was the peace and love spirit out there. Everybody said have a blessed day. <laughs> like trying to be more more uh, nice to each other. All of a sudden, just because they got trying to yeah. um, trying to uplift themselves because somebody got judged out there. People that people got, actually got shot up out there, even yeah. though it was a false flag set up by Esau. People really got put to death, just like 9/11. It was a false flag set up by Esau, but people really got put to death. People still get sacrificed, man. It's all a sort of sort of slack, y'all. It's all a part of Esau sacrificing to his his god Satan. You know, at the end of the day, if you're not in on it, man, those those people are just what casualties. Yeah. <laughs> all right, they're they're uh uh. uh their sacrifices, man. Esau, Esau sacrifices them to his demons, so he can try to further on what he trying to do, man. Cause he behind the scenes, uh, uh, trying to get this new world order popping, man. You know, you got to like what you, you was going. Uh, I just continue reading. Okay. It says uh, Isaiah fourteen and seven. The whole earth is at rest hmm. and it's quiet and break forth in the singing. Yeah, it's gonna be a, that's that's gonna be the time when it's when it's when it's party time. All right. And every the whole earth is gonna be in unison. All right, every everybody's everybody's gonna be uh, uh uh feeling good, man. You know, cause everything is gonna go back into its proper order. All right, everything is gonna be uh, uh replenished. Okay, you know, hey man, and even you, DT the nations, they're gonna be they're gonna be happy. Hey man, cause they they're not gonna be being oppressed like they are under the hands of Esau. We're gonna treat them uh fairly. All right. We're gonna deal. We're gonna deal with them according to the scriptures, man. Everything that that Esau uh, 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 refused to abide by, we're gonna we're gonna install it. You know. It says, "Yea, the fir tree rejoice at thee, and the cedars in the Lebanon sing, since thou art laid down, no fillers come up against us." That's right, man. You're not gonna have Esau cutting down these uh, uh, cutting down trees for fun, just for the fuck of it. All right, you know. And what's what's coming up, man? Wicked ass Christmas, all right? Esau gonna be chopping a lot of wood, man. You know, printing out this fake ass money, okay? You know, just for the hell of it, building up, building up these useless ass buildings for you to slave in more warehouses, all right? More waste of space, and while he's further what, pushing Jake out of the neighborhoods, pushing pushing uh uh, uh pushing people closer together to where you gotta live. Uh, uh, and, and, and closed by like Six different families Okay You got motherfuckers on top of you Beside you 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 just pretty much Sandwiched by different Different motherfuckers man All over You know That's that's all Esau Okay But what he's not He's gonna be he's, There ain't gonna be no Edomite To be chopping Chopping down trees Polluting the air Polluting the water Alright Changing people uh, uh, Living situations You know Alright Go ahead, I. So it's hell from beneath is moved from thee to meet thee at thy coming, and stir up, up the dead for thee, even all the chief ones of the earth, and have raised up from their thrones the, all the kings of the nations. All they shall speak and say unto thee, Art thou also become weak as we? Yeah, man, that's what the, that's what you see these nations saying. You know, and brothers can chime in too. You see how these different meetings. All right, Putin be talking his shit. All right, Duterte be talking his shit. The Ven Venezuelan uh, uh, president was talking his shit. Kim Jong Un talk his shit all the damn time. All these, all these different uh, uh, kings, these different nations are popping their shit, man. Popping their Esau. All right, saying, man, hey, hey man, this is the same devil that was saying we got the strongest military, this and that. If you don't like it, you can do this, you can do that. You know, he talking all that shit. Now what? The tables, the tables has tur have turned. You know? Yeah, they they to the point to where like with the North Korea situation, like back back uh, back when Esau was at the height of his power, they wouldn't have been able to do it, talk all that shit like they do now. They saying basically if you do anything wrong to us, we gonna all we gotta do is press a button. 
Yeah. If we feel offended in any way, all I gotta do is just press a button. They got a, they got um, North Korea got they satellite up in the air. They they talking about they could um, take out America's e, um, electrical system, and then if an EMP happened in Babylon, it's a wrap. That's right. Everything's ran by electricity. Nothing's nothing's done old fashioned like it used to be. Yep. So everybody's asked out if anything like that was to happen. Yep. And you see that you see that in that um they had a movie on um. I think the the History Channel or some shit like the that, but American basically American Blackout. Blackout. Yeah, it showed it all. It all happened from a, a EMP attack. It shows you how how dependent you Americans are on on um on energy. You know, electricity, lights. All right, Syn synthetic lights, man. Not not real sunlight. All right, artificial. I mean, artificial light, not real natural sunlight. All right, your computers, your cars. All that, man. Your heaters, your AC, refrigerators, gas, all right, natural gases and whatnot, you know? And then you people were at each other next, man. It's, and it's good work. The prophets are telling you this, all right? And what? And, and not only the, uh, the kings of the earth, hey, man, we're, we're also telling you Edomites, man. We're, we're looking down at you, down on you. Like, hey, ain't this the same devil that, that was uh, uh, hosing Jake down, you know, in the 50s and 60s, spitting on Jake, all right? Saying nigger get out of here Beating up Jake And now we're cussing you out in your face man The scriptures say Then uh, then will they stand Then shall the righteous stand in great boldness Before the face of such as have afflicted them That's right man That's the that's spirit man Cause hey The prophets are doing that today man Hey man this gotta be the, the spirit of Yahweh Bashim Yahweh Shai Cause a man on his own accord cannot do this man Niggas are bugged out that that uh, that prophets from our apostles and elders on down are here are still here on the corners cussing he saw to his face, man. That the Lord is really with us, you know, because this is not of our own accord, man. It says in Acts, if this will be of men, this, this council will come to naught. This is not of men. This is of Yahweh Bashim Yahweh Shai. This is the truth, man. You know, and this this is the spirit. He saw you. You're out of here. You know, child. You can take down the videos. All right. You can send agents to camp. I mean, his truth is already out there, and his truth is going to continue to do what the Lord wanted to do until until the job is done. All right, you ain't stopping shit. You know, you're out of here. You're through, Esau. You got it. All right. Says, "Art thou become like unto us? Thy pump is brought down to the grave, and thy noise and the noise of thy vows. The worm. It says, the worms is spread under thee, and the worms cover thee." How art thou fallen from heaven, O Lucifer, son of the morning? Yeah, yeah you fall, you, you've uh, uh, fallen from your strength, man. You know, and that's why they're the uh, uh, the wicked elites, man. They were they're they're known as what the Illuminati's until what the um, their whole because what they they call they deem themselves as the uh, the Illuminated ones because they they have they know uh, they know everything. You know, they, they they know they know as much as the Lord allows them to know. You know, cause what to know to tell the truth? You have, I mean, to tell a lie, you have to know the truth. You know, these wicked at least they know that they're Edomites. They know that they're the devil. They know who the Israelites are, which are us, the so-called Negro, Latino, Native American man, woman, and child. All right, and they know their their ultimate uh, um, their destiny is is, is slavery and, and to be uh, exterminated. And they know Yahweh Shah is on the way back. They know all these things, man. But what the jig is up, the Lord. The Lord has uh, sh shed the light on their darkness, all right? He's exposed them through, through his prophets, all right? Through the unicorn, through this internet, all right? Could, this had to be one of the worst uh, uh, one of the worst uh, tools that Esau have used to, to destroy himself next to the, the missiles, <laughs> you know? Because that's going to be the thing to take Esau out of here, you know? His own, he, he, created, he created all this for his own downfall, man. He, he had no clue. How art thou cut to the ground Which didn't weaken the nations yep. he, he weakened all the nations He made. The, he tried to make all the nations Dependent upon him yep. That everybody has to deal with the dollar Everybody, they need democracy Like Babylon That's why all the nations hate, hate America Divide and conquer that's how, you got it. that's how you got every single nation under your hand You know, divide and conquer Bring, cause a false uh, terrorist attacks Bringing up a country on, uh, uh, against another country. Setting up puppet leaders. Yep. Mm -hmm. It said, For thou hast said in thy heart, I will ascend into heaven. I will exalt my throne above the stars of the Most High. 
I will sit also upon the mount of the congregation in the sides of the north. I will ascend above the heights of the clouds. I will be like the Most High. And that's what Esau wanted to do. He wanted to be like Yahweh Bashem Yahweh Shai, man. That's why he, he tried to do them heart transplants, kidney transplants, do all these different things to 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 make himself feel like he is the Most High. Got artificial cameras, intelligence. cameras everywhere, artificial intelligence. He got chips and everything, so he could track everybody. Yep. He tried to trying to be like Yahweh Bashem Yahweh Shai, because the Lord knows where everybody's at. The Lord knows what you do the Lord behind makes, the scenes. Makes man and woman, and children makes children. Yeah, right. the Lord creates you how you come out. Yeah. You got Esau trying to tap it with your genes. Food, you know. Yeah. Says, Yet shall thou be brought down to hell to the size of the pit. They that see thee shall narrowly look upon thee and consider thee, saying, Is this the man that made the earth to tremble, that did it, that did shake kingdoms? Yeah, that's yeah. what every oh, good, so like, yeah, that's what everybody's saying. That's what we saying. All right, that's what we about to go out here and say it once again. That's what these nations are saying. Is this the damn? Is this the devil? Is this the Edomite? You know, who proud red ass walked around with his nose up, talking all that shit, kicking up dust. You yeah. know, just imagine like every every Edomite bum you see. That's gonna be the every the average Edomite. Mm -hmm. That's that's how they all gonna be looking. You are gonna be looking at them just like you look at an Edomite bum with disgust. Esau the kingdom. That's just gonna be they going That's a regular Edomite look. You gonna look at them like this the piece of shit that was ruling over me. Yeah, yeah. scriptures say the uh, the most high ruler in the kingdom of men, men and give it to it to whosoever he will, and set it up over it the bases yes, of men, man. which yep. means the low, 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 low men, which is the so-called white men. Yeah, the lowest scum on the earth. Yeah. Right. You know, the, uh, a man that has no morals, he has no no type of way to govern himself. He's just a, a freak of nature. You know, and he yes, needs sir. to be destroyed. And he, you can see the earth under his rulership. Everything is fucked up. The air is polluted. The water is polluted. Everybody's sick. The women are all out of order. All because of what the so-called white man, which is the devil that the Bible speaks of, is wreaking havoc on the earth. That's right. And that's why the Lord is going to send his son, Yahweh Shai, back to clean this earth up. To enslave all these nations, starting with the so-called white men, and, and with the elites and all the rest of the heathen nations, and put them in slavery, you know? That's right. It says, Yet thou shalt be brought down to hell to the sides of the pit, it says, they that see thee shall nearly look upon thee and consider thee saying, is this the man that made the earth to tremble, that did shake kingdoms, that made the world as a wilderness and destroyed the cities thereof, that opened not the house of his prisoners? Yeah, that's right, man. You made the world a wilderness. Everywhere you go, you just, you cause destruction and chaos. You know, you mess up everybody's culture. All right. You just, you just turn everything upside down and you destroy, you destroy lands, man. You destroy people, all right? And here is the biggest, this is the prison camp, man. America is a big ass prison, all right? You know, uh, 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 you can't do nothing without Esau's uh, permission, man. Yeah. And here it is, uh, OJ just got out. They still fucking with him. OJ just fucking got out, man, because Esau couldn't get him over that Edomite bitch, so what? They had they had to uh, uh, get him for what? I believe he stole, stole took his back own, his own, own shit, shit, you know? But this is supposed to be the land of the free and this and that, man. He was he was already already guilty. That's that hatred for Jacob, you know. And he, 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 hey, man, you 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 have a lot of Israelites still still locked up to this day, man. And really, we all we're all prisoners, man. We're debt slaves, you know. Yeah. You gonna pay for that? Too. You gonna pay for that, man? That's right. He said that made the world as a wilderness and destroyed cities thereof that opened not the house of his prisoner. All the kings of the nations, even all of them lie in glory, even one is in his own house. But thou art cast out of thy grave like an abominable branch, and as the remnant of, the, of those that are slain, thrust through with the sword, that go down to the stores of the pit, as the carcass trotted underfoot. Mm -hmm. Yeah, these other nations, they're, they're going after a thousand years, they're going to get back their land, you know? We're gonna deal with them uh, fairly, man. They just gotta take this ill. But as far as you, Esau, ain't no coming back for you. All right, you know, that's it. Okay. It says, "Thou shalt not be joined with them in burial, because thou has destroyed their land, thy land, and the slain of thy people. The seed of evildoers shall never be re uh, renowned. Renowned. Yep. 
prepare slaughter for his children for the iniquity of their fathers. That's right, man. That's that's what we tell you devils out there, man. You motherfuckers that that try to say, oh, that was, that was my grandparents or that was that was disgusting, off-brand uh, Edomite. You know, we're we're different. You know, we're a new breed of Edomites. Nah, y'all are the same devils, man. Really, you're the same devil from back then. You know, there's a such thing as reincarnation, all right? Like uh, Ecclesiastes, there's no there's no new thing under the sun. It's the same demonic spirits put back in the same uh, uh, red uh, decrepit flesh, man. You know. Hey man, so we're we're tell uh we're 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 prepared we're reading you your judgment, all right? Cause the slaughter is is coming, okay? It's gonna be a, a lot of blood a, a lot of blood shed, man. Yeah. All right, you niggas involved as well, cause you went on America, you love it here. Niggas said last weekend, we we said wow well, truly, I love it here, and the nigga was genuinely uh he he's he was sincere in saying that, you know? Hey man, that's a, that's uh you two thirds uh, uh mentality. You love it here, man. You know, you got you even got niggas in the camps, bro. You know? Being a demon. Alright? And the Lord the Lord is gonna get you guys, man. You know, you niggas are being Edomites, man. You know? Complete Edomites. It says prepare slaughter for his children for the iniquity of their fathers, that they do not rise, nor possess the land, nor fill the face of the world with cities. Yeah, that's right, man. You know? So what, you Edomites are going to be slaughtered on this end, all right, via what? The race wars, okay? When uh, 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 when the elect is given those new bodies, you know? When Yahweh Shai come back with the angels, you, you, hey, man, the Lord's going to get get down. He's going to get his, his garment bloody as well. Yeah, you hey. still got to be paid back for what your forefathers did, like the scripture said. So it's, it's that on top of everything you're doing to this very day. That's why scriptures say your sins, the sins have reached into heaven. Because Esau's been doing, Esau's been fucking with us ever since he's he's been like in rulership. Before Babylon was established, he was fucking with us in the reincarnation. So Esau got a lot to pay for. You know, you know that's one of the first nations we went to war with when we left Egypt. Mm -hmm. you know, so you eat them, you, your tab is reaching to the heavens. I got this scripture, this is uh, Job 20 and 4. Knowest thou not this of old, since man was placed upon the earth, that the triumph of the wicked is short, and the joy of the hypocrite but for a moment? Yeah, yeah. This, this thing is going to be quick, you know, because this is a, a, a short rule. Esau hasn't been in rulership for that long, man. It's, it, it's been very short, and he's done a lot of destruction and, and, and spread a lot of wickedness in, in such short time, you know? No, you, you yeah, you go. Oh, uh, no. Oh, okay. Yeah, we good. Jake wanted to wrap it up. Yeah, we could wrap it up. It says, Though his excellency see mount up to the heavens and his hair reach to the clouds, yet he shall perish forever like his own dung. Yeah, they say they, they like to say uh, when you when you go head to the top, the only way is down, you know? And Esau has reached his pinnacle of of of, re, uh, of, of wickedness, you yeah. know? That's why the Lord said he has to speed up the times because Esau's he's at the pinnacle of wickedness yeah. to where he really has control damn near the whole world. His his new world order is almost in full effect. So he got to be taken down. It says, though his ex excellency mount up to the heavens and his hair reach to the, uh, to the clouds, yet he shall perish forever like his own dung. They which have seen him shall say, where is he? He shall fly away as a dream and shall not be found. Yea, he shall... Be cast away as the vision of the night. Yeah, we yeah. yeah, so it's yeah. all it's all gonna be like a, a nightmare, man. Cause this is a nightmare, man. Waking up here in Babylon every day is like waking up in a reoccurring fucking horrible nightmare. All right, you know these demons are embracing this month, uh, uh, October, man. They're gonna be very like demonic, man. It's a very demonic month, man. You know. And they, and, they, and they like what they like all these these horror movies and this and that man this is like waking up in, in the freddy krueger uh movie uh every day man waking up to esau he he's he's freddy on this side man you know fucking um um what should i call it uh oppressing us man just giving us all sorts of hell you know hey man so that nightmare is going to be over then then the table is going to be turned man you know, now and then it's it, it's gonna become a nightmare for Esau. Yeah. You know? A role reversal. Yeah. You know, trading places. That's right, man. It's gonna be every it's gonna be beautiful to wake up in the kingdom for us, man. They they gonna be itching to itch, itching uh, to get the day started.
you know? Yeah, yeah man. Hey, man. So, Jake, see what's going on, man. Uh, Esau, like usual with his handiwork, is, is messy, tacky. All right. And, and, and hey, man, it's, it's not it's not deceiving the elect, man. The Lord's the Lord's men. We see exactly what Esau is doing. All right. The Lord, the Lord revealed the secrets unto us. We know exactly how things have to go, and we and we see it happening. It's just these these uh, uh, these Babylonians that have no clue what Esau is has has in store for them, you know. But hey, we we know the we know the we know the uh, uh, the uh, the beginning, the middle, and the ending of all this, man. You know. So we we're just watching it uh, play out, man. You know, and Lord's will. We can continue to uh, to endure this thing, all right. Stay strong, you know. Stay firm in the spirit of Yahweh Bashem Yahweh Shai, and stay uh, in unity. Stay stay brotherly, you know. Don't 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 be like don't be like uh, the two thirds of our own nation, man. Let that be an example for us not to uh, not to aspire to, to be anything like man. Not to uh, utilize any of those those negative demonic attributes of being a nigga, you know. Kind of fit bros. You know? Yeah. And so with that we're gonna give all praises again to Yahweh, Bashem, Yahweh Shai, double honors to our apostles and elders, and Shalom to the Akim out there. Shalom, my Shalom.